just to wrap up, somebody made a comment on the Facebook page that if they were labor, they wouldn't build a school. Lady people who sat there for seven years and didn't build it, go do it. The problem in that kind of thinking is what got Sink it's a Nevis where it is today. Sink is a Nevis is a great federation, and we have made some strides. But if we made 50 strides in 40 years, if we had a different mentality, we could have made 200 strides in 40 years. But because of some bad mind people, because of the, the, the political football back and forth, we aren't where we could be. And I keep saying this over and over. We aren't where we could be. Look at our infrastructure. Saying so that Nevis ain't had a proper infrastructure overhaul, upgrade, and maintenance for a while. Somebody somewhere feel like paving the road is the biggest infrastructure thing that we could do. But we are growing as a country. We're looking to get more flights. You look at any terminal around the world that caters to a lot of flights, like a hub. Look at their terminal as compared to ours. Look at our port facilities. Look at our roads. You could barely fit two vehicles on it now. If we get a good, decent hurricane in Zengis and Nevis, I don't know what's going to become of us. And that is why God has been protecting us for so long. Because we cannot take it. We just had some rain. Just a week and a rain. And look at how we roads them get washed out. Because government is supposed to be a continuous thing. A continuous looking after of our infrastructure. Upgrading and maintaining. Every school here we got to go and repair schools. Fix bar rooms. Do this. Do that. Do this. And celebrate it like it's a big achievement. We have to come in and repaint and fix. That's supposed to be ongoing throughout the school year. Ain't that we got public works for? But when you talk, oh, don't say nothing because guess what? These people have feelings too. But these people need to get up and say, what is the hindrance from them executing their jobs on a daily basis? Ever so often you hear some government office got to close down. Because I'm old. He got to move and go away there. So he got to go, go. And we're paying and we hiring more and more people. I went to the, 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 the budget consultation for the community. And when you look at the figures as to how much our wage bill is. The government are higher and are pay more people than anybody else in the country. And yet still things can't be done properly and if we move a stone from day to day we got a big ceremony and a big song and dance about it i'm not saying you can't celebrate achievements but good god almighty man where is the continuous plan for the upkeep and the maintenance and the the the, 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 the upgrading of our infrastructure as a country and then you just hear these lofty words from high government ranking officials, sustainability, and all these kind of lovely words. And then when you look around, in actuality, nothing to all go so. Thank you for joining us on KN Whoop. I am Alvarine Cable, affectionately known as Bright Eyes. Have a wonderful day.